Good day, folks! Welcome back to Elite Dangerous once again. I hope you're doing well. So, we're back again, once again, the Lloyd, the Lloyd White Station. What's it called again? Lloyd White Orbital, yeah. So, some players, I think they, like, choose a home base. I don't think I'm going to choose this one. I have another base somewhere else. It's called the Fletcher Station. That's in another system. Uh, I'm just going to show you the map. See what I'm talking about. Yeah, here we go. So gonna fitting here in the NGA in Jolkin system. So yeah. Okay, I just wanna see if they have a new ship available. Or any new ships. I had to check at the other station, but I just wanna see if they have anything different here. The Eagle. These ones are cheaper the way, in the 100,000 range, I'm pretty sure. The Cobra Mark III? Mm. Type 6 Transporter. I'm not really interested in those. The Killback. ASP Scout. The Vulture. I don't know. I'm, let's see. Culture Dynamics Push Experience the Limit. Additional one multi crew seats, okay. Let's see components it has. Yeah. Let's see. We have this one, the seven type seven transporter. Yeah. So I was having a chat with Jarmic and uh where he pointed out that I should get the uh the uh, what's it called? The Anaconda? Or something else. I don't know what the name was, but I forgot they. But I want to get something that, like, has uh, uh, good speed, able to travel, good defense, something awesome. <laughs> I'm just going to look at the mission board of it to see if we can do any deliveries. I need to start working on how to, how to start mining. So I might start doing a job like that and see how we go. Uh, destination, where's that go? How can you deliver 4,500 units? Wow. Yeah, I need to, ju uh, need to do job sets. Wow. Give me more credits. Let's see. Deliver 8 units? That's not bad though. This is an illegal one, isn't it? Harmless. Yeah, the thing is, I did a job like this where it tells me that uh, Interactive Hub X Turnable. I got a bounty or fine, whatever it was. So, yeah. It's not good. I don't like going for those. Because it tells you you're going to do a destination, but then, you know, you're an enemy to some faction, I think. So, I'm going to deliver these eight units right here. I've been doing a lot of these. There we go. Cargo hold at maximum capacity. Oh yeah, the cargo is uh, full because I bought a uh, frameshift drive interdictor. Just see here. Oh, where was it? Yeah, right here. I haven't worked out how to use it yet. I saw a video, so it seems kind of simple. Not that simple. I also made an adjustment with the weapons I have. I got cannons instead, so way better. They take limited ammo. So one job. Let's go choose the mission. I'll get to the mission. Right here. That's where I'm going. Wait, did it say I had to make two jumps? Oh, I see. I'm right here. Okay, I get it now. Okay, let's go. So I looked at the ships that the fish are chased in. They have this thing called the Dolphin. I'm quite interested in having it. Actually purchasing it. 
But we'll see if it's still there. God, there's someone there. Oh god, that's close. Okay, let's wait the frame to drive. So I worked out how to use the uh, website to locate uh, different components, optionals, or you know, mark different markets. I see how handy it is. It's quite handy. So I might use that next time, next recording session, or the next video. I've been doing a lot of missions off camera with the Viper Mark III, so I'm really interested in buying a new ship. So I can get better jobs done. Frame drive charging. Sometimes, sometimes I overheat it because I charge the frame shift drive way too close to a sun or star. Yeah. <laughs> Watch out for that. Mitchell Port, I think I've been here once. Oh yeah, 2,000 light years. Uh, light seconds away, not light years. It's taken ages to get 2,000 light years. <laughs> Yeah, but for those who are new to the game watching, the galaxy map in this is it's humongous. Obviously, it makes sense because you have, if you have all the stars in the galaxy, it will take you ages. Because every jump, or well, what I have, is like about 12 light years. But it take you like 25,000 light years to get to like one side of the galaxy, you know. It'll take you days. I also have to work out how to get a, uh, a soul passport. Uh, to get to the soul system. Uh, I don't know what passport I need. I'm just going to slide out on it so I can have, take a look at this. Yes, yeah, so it requires soul system permit. I don't know how to get that, so if someone in the, co in the comments uh, would like to show me how to get it, or explain to me how to get it, That'd be very helpful, because I read all comments. Considering that I have that many viewers per video, so yeah, I'm not, I'm not that big of a content creator. I'm not. I'm really not. I'm sure, if a thousand. But you always get uh, the lower number of viewers than the number you have of subscribers. I'm always going to have the round the 6 second mark, I want to keep that 7 because that's the best. So once you get to 5 it's like basically, you know, too late, 9 times out of 10, you know, because you'll just go too fast, you can't slow down enough time. So if that happens I just like spiral around downwards and then, you know, hit the station like that. Kind of works out really well.
here we are. Nicely done. I mean, thinking about getting a joystick and control the ship around, I think that'd be better. That'd be much fun. It actually would be really fun, though. myself. Okay, zero 06, where is it? It's gonna let the AI do its thing. Oh, there we go. How handy. <laughs> awesome. That's an easy 100,000 credits. Sometimes I, I'm encounter pirates. Doesn't really hop, happen often. In case, in case you're like carrying really precious cargo, I think. I'm not interested in influence or personal weapons. Like these things, they give you units or reputation influence. I just want. I can, well, if I choose this one, I get still the bonuses as well. So it's still pretty good. Yeah. Okay. So now I want to get to that other station. Let's refuel. Yeah, okay, there we go. I also found a neutron star. I'm pretty sure that, that that is a neutron star. Was it here? I don't know. It was one of these. I think it was this one here. Was that it? No. Oh, it might be right here. I think that's the one. Yeah, so you get a longer jump basically. So I have rights of uh, French Drive. Sector five Come on. Still not bored of those jumps, it's so epic. <laughs> it's so cool. 
And as for here, the NJLKIN system, or Injokin, I'm just gonna call it that. Come to the French station. So I was still offered uh, to join that, uh, well, the faction I was invited to by that, by that guy, I forgot his name. I didn't think I want to because I kind of want to just do things myself because I think a faction means you got to participate or, you know, do things their way. I was like, no, I kind of want to just, you know, I just want to do what I want to do, you know. If someone wants to kind of, you know, do missions together, well, I can still do that. It can be arranged. I don't even know if there are multiplayer missions, like you, like co-op missions. Is, is that a, even a thing? I don't even know if that is a thing. I'm hoping there is. I mean, not one you like. Well, a co-op mission where you know, like something like uh, this, like a crew of fighters. They join your ship and stuff. Like each ship, each basically. Sorry now because of this planet on the left of me. So I feel that's which way I come in. Uh, well, I'm able to find the app basically. Oh god. Completely missed that. So like I said, I'm still mostly harmless. That's the rank. I thought I was something higher, but uh, no, not really. Let's go do more missions, I suppose. Is that me or the fridge stations like orbiting like, really fast? It was kind of moving when I was like heading towards it. Okay, so we're here, so I had to, uh, well, can't meet myself because I was eating, so, yeah. Don't want that noise, basically. Okay, let's check the, uh, what they've got here. Okay, shipyard. So if they still have the dolphin, I'll take it. 
Uh, I'm thinking about this one, the Imperial Carrier. Or Korea. It's not Korea, not Carrier, it's Korea. The Imperial Cori or Korea? Korea. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> so they have Imperial Clipper, but that's 22 million. There's the Orca, or the Orsa. The Ferdinand's. Uh, heavy combat ship. That's interesting. There's no way I'm close to have enough for that. It's like 55 million. Yeah, there's no way. The Python. I think that's what Jamaica suggested me to get. Wow, 200 million. Wow. I might just get the Imperial Korea. We got Tamara. So it's. Oh, this is. Yeah, what's in that print? Uh, let's see here. One of the most compact vessels on the market. The Imperial carries the lightweight combat ship from Katamura. Or Katamura. With the ability or agility to revive with the Vive at Mach 3. Well, that's what I have. The Korea is adapting and defending and coming fire when it's 3 million hard points with, with made it popular with those who want a balance of power and style. Yeah, well, that's something I want. Yeah. Purchase options. Requires Empire rank of Master. Alright. Seriously? Oh, there's the dolphin. That's what I was looking for. Yeah, I'll, okay, I'll get the dolphin instead. It's 1 million credits. Let's see here. Um, I'm going to store the current ship. I'm not going to exchange it, I just want to store it. Oh, here I am. <laughs> oh, this looks interesting. So it's meant to look like a dolphin. Actually, yeah. If finally there's a button... Hey, can someone in the comments tell me, like, which button it is to look outside? I mean, have third-person view? You know, to see the ship? Because I, I don't know which button it is. So it'd be very helpful. Anyways, let's see what we've got. Okay, outfitting. Oh, this is a nice... Uh... Oh, my ship is bigger, I see. Yeah, That's a pretty nice looking ship, though. Okay. I think it's meant for a lot of transport. Well, I can do passengers. Okay. Uh, we can go 1E, e, 1F. Wait, what was that? Why is that one? Oh, it's the same thing. Okay, it's going to be my 1F. 500,000 credits? Wow. Yeah, I think I'm about to go for some, uh, power plant options here. Okay, well, we've got 4A power plant? Ooh, I'm, I'm interested in this one. That's 1.4 million. I don't think I want to spend that much. I think I'm just going to have to go for 3A instead. Let's exchange it so it's cheaper. Okay, now for the frame shift drive. Uh, what have you got? Oh, 4A. I am tempted. That draws a lot of power though. we we'll go for 3A. We go for the 4B. I'm tempted. Okay, it tells me the jump. 18, 19, 20 years. Okay. Yeah, we can go for that. Yeah, it doesn't seem that bad. Okay, so this one 15 and 16. Now we'll go for the 4B.
Oh yeah. Okay, we're back for that uh, old jump cut. Sorry about that. Anyways, what was I doing again? Oh yeah, bulk heads. Yeah, I'm not gonna mess around with those. I think they're the armor. I think. There was five thrusters. Oh, I could go for something better. Exceed maximum mass. Wait, what? What you talking about? Okay, five E. We've got. 4A. Uh, this is quite expensive stuff, by the way. I really need to go for like a power plant, like something way better. I don't know if this means. Yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna purchase this one because it's it's honestly better. Yeah, there we go. Uh, 4C fuel tank. We'll change it around. We'll get a. Uh... Which one's better? I think I have the best one, I think. Yeah, 16 tons. Uh, sensors. Uh, I'm not really interested in extra sensors. I mean, we could go for 3A sensors. They drop a lot of power. Like, a lot. We'll just go for the 3D ones. I'm not sure if, like, if the red means there's too much power. I mean, retracted and deployed. So I think that the deployed power is higher than the retracted, it's still good, but the max is 15 megawatts. I think that's what it means there, so I'm going to go for the 3A. Okay, so 4E life support. We'll go for the 4A. Again, that's quite something. A bit expensive, that. 10 minutes, sure. Okay, so thrusters, we want to go something better, 4A, I don't know about that, 4B, the 4C doesn't seem so bad, let's go for the 4C, okay, sorry for that jump cut that just happened, anyways, uh, still thinking about getting one of these, so this one's 1 1.2 million, that's quite a lot, I think I'll just get the, uh, one one B instead. Hang on, jump current range. Are oh, these lower the range? I see. Okay, I'll just keep the one C. Is there anything else I need to look at? No. Okay. All right, let's go for hard points. I wanted to get some uh, beam lasers. It says I already have these installed. Core internal, we've done that. Let's go for the optional internal. Oh, we have a... Wait, how, what's a what's a cap? Wait, 8. We, we can carry it to 14? Wow. 5e economy class passenger. Cabin capacity 16. That's not bad. Can I go for an upgrade? Ah, oh, here we go. Passenger cabins. So we've got this one. We can go higher. Nah, it's not much difference. Yeah. I'll we'll leave it as it is. Uh, cargo rack is fine. Four each shield generator. Let's try to go for something a bit better than that. I uh, go for three E. That takes up power. Four B. Uh, that takes up a lot of power too. Eh? Go for three B. Like, I really like the shields, though. Like, they're quite important. I think I'll just go for the 3A shield generator. Okay, we have empty, empty compartments. Alright. Is there any frame shift uh, interdictors? Oh, here we go. What have we got here? 
They're practically the same. Why would I want to get 900,000 one? Could just get a 1C. Yeah, that's not so bad. Alrighty, looking good. Looking good. Okay, stored modules. Yeah, alright, we're pretty much good. Okay, let's check the mission board. I can do a lot of deliveries here, carry seven. I could do that for 110,000. Yeah, I'll take that one. 100,000, meh. Could settle for at least 200,000. I don't know how to do these ones though. Like, I don't even have access to them. I need to increase my reputation or the faction reputation. Just for elite. God damn it. What about this one? Harmless? Uh, this one's a known terrorist. Interact pump access external darling. Yeah, I think I did one of these before and I got it in a fine. Yeah, I'd rather do one with a beacon. I don't want to go to a hub turnable access thingy. Same on Megaship's turrets. Yeah. There's a few of those, but uh. Yep, that's all I have, unfortunately. Anyways. I shall deliver one of the cargoes to one of the places. And test out the ship. Hopefully, the video doesn't last too long. No, that's not what I'm. What, I need to get to here, that's right. The auto launch. Here we go. Okay, let's get to over here. So I'll only do this mission and I'll finish the other one off off camera. Landing gear retracted. Oh hell yeah. Oh. Okay, let's just do it automatically. Well, I get this really nice, you know, much better view. Are you gonna go anywhere, audio? Autopilot is not even doing anything. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Sometimes it's just idle, waiting for other ships. I haven't got time for that. Hell yeah! <laughs> that looks, looks so good! Can I see it behind me? No.
what am I going to... Uh, the Alcala Settlement. Okay. I really like the ship though. So cool. But I imagine it's like a, it's like it's mostly for passengers so I think. Yeah, it's like an airship basically. Oh, I did put the other weapons on these. Oh, well, I'm going to have to do that off camera unfortunately. I'll fix that up. I might do a stream of LA really Dangerous. We'll see. I'm going to set up like a, a voting feedback se uh, section in the Discord. So that's all the users and viewers can choose. What they would prefer to see. Too close, too fast. Okay, time for my technique. It's working. Almost. Still coming way too fast. No! God damn it. That's a weird sound. Dang, I like the acceleration. Okay, so after this episode, um, I'm basically like gonna try and work out how to do some mining uh, off camera and pick up passengers and do some career jobs. I, I don't know. Um, but yeah, like I said, all the other things I mentioned in this video, if you can work out how to tell me or how to get a soul passport, you know, things like that. I'm not sure what else I mentioned, but yeah, next episode I might uh, do some passing jobs in mining, but we'll see. Okay, well, I'm just going to complete this. Is it Akala or Asala? I don't know, I think I'm just called it Asala? Akala? I don't know. <laughs> the Alcala station. Easy. Didn't have to do with any pirates. Uh, reputation now, just got 110,000. Try to get those credits back because I spent a lot of them. Alright, awesome. Well, thanks everyone for watching this video of Elite Dangerous. Hope you enjoyed, and if you did, remember to like the video and subscribe to tune into the series. I've got a Discord link below, you can join that if you like, and I shall see you next time in another video. So until then, have a good day.